Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 11.07 a.m., and it's Thursday, July 1st, 2021, day is the first day of July, but I'm um, anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing an energy drink that I found at the 7-Eleven gas station in Oklahoma City. I wasn't expecting to find this there, and um, they had three different flavors of this brand, so I got all three of them to review, because I went there um, a couple of days ago to try to get the new um, exclusive bang flavor at 7-Eleven. I went on June 28th, which was the official release date, but um, I guess they didn't have it yet. So, you know, but I get, did get some drinks at least to review, so you know what I mean about them anyway. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing the original flavor of this brand. It's the original Triton Energy Drink. So, oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. 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 As a sore top, the sore tab. Bob was a Best Buy date and production code. Best Buy. Um, July 14th or 19th, 21. So it's actually only Best Buy. Um, about two weeks. So, you know. So, and this one's already close to the Best Buy date. So that's interesting. And um, the 7-Eleven that I went to um, was like sort of like a, not that good of a, like a busy one, you know. Um, it was more of like a run down 7-Eleven. See what I mean? A little bit in a tougher neighborhood, you know, just saying. But um, anyway. Um, yeah, it says Triton, energy drink for the mind and body. Original natural caffeine. It's 200 milligrams. Ultheanine, no artificial color. 16 blood ounces, 1 pint, 473 milliliters. So, yeah. But anyway... Around the top it says zero sugar, L-theanine, and it says that all the way around the top of it. Caffeine extracted from green tea, low calorie. Shows like a lot of stars, and it shows like an astronaut, I think. And his face looks like, sort of like the Chrome browser, like app logo, you know. And it has like the swirly pattern, you know. And it has like stars and stuff, it looks like a pretty cool can, you know. L-theanine is an amino acid that naturally occurs in green tea. Triton fuels your adventures, made with zero sugar and L-theanine, which smooths the impact of caffeine to give you weightless energy without the same jittery feeling as caffeine alone. So yeah, this won't make you as lit, you know, but um, because it has the L-theanine and stuff. But you know what I mean? But um, anyway, you still probably shouldn't drink having anxiety problems and stuff, or like heart conditions and other stuff, but you know what I mean? Because yeah, it has 200 milligrams caffeine, so ah oh, yeah, boys, it will get you lit, you know, just saying. So ah oh, yeah. Consume responsibly. This drink is not recommended for children, pregnant, or nursing women, or people sensitive to caffeine. Warning not recommended for use by individuals under 18 years of age. Too much caffeine may cause nervousness, irritability, sleeplessness, and occasionally rapid heartbeat. One serving of Triton provides 200 milligrams of caffeine, which is more than two cups of coffee. It has a crown logo with SKU and some other codes. It contains 0% juice. Nutrition pack serving size 1 can, 473 milliliters. Amount per serving, calories 20. Total fat 0 grams, 0%, sodium 470 milligrams, 20%. Total carbohydrates, 5 grams, 2%. Total sugar, 0 grams. Includes 0 grams added sugar, 0%. Protein, 0 grams. And the text is a little bit messed up, so it's a little bit hard to see. Um, especially where it says, like, protein and the sodium and total carbohydrates and stuff. Um, it looks a little bit too bold, like too much ink um, printed on the can. But um, anyway, calcium, 15 milligrams, 2%. Potassium, 29 milligrams, 0%. Nice and... Uh, I think 16 milligrams, 100%. Vitamin B6, 2 milligrams, 120%. Vitamin B12, 5.4 micrograms, 230%. Has other ingredients, has natural flavors. Distributed by 7-Eleven Incorporated, Irving, Texas, 75063, www.711.com. Caffeine content is 200 milligrams per serving. Satisfaction guaranteed, phone numbers 1-800-255-0711. So 7-Eleven, you know, this is, I guess, their brand of energy drinks. But yeah, um, even though it's their store brand, um, still a little bit expensive. It was $2.39 before tax, you know, where I got it at. So yeah, it should be um, definitely cheaper though, you know, since especially since it's like their store brand. But you know what I mean? But um, anyway, yeah, I'll let you see the can right quick. Um, not too much stuff on the can, but you know what I mean? It's very reflective though a little bit. Yeah. a cool background pattern and stuff. 
like the stars and the astronaut guy. It might be a deep sea diver, I'm not really for sure. Maybe an astronaut though. Especially, you know, because it has like stars. But, um, that part looks like a little bit like bubbles though. So, I'm not really for sure. But yeah, it does look a little bit like an astronaut, but he has these like things hanging out of his neck and stuff. Reminds me of like um, scuba divers or something. But you know what I mean? But um, anyway. Very cool looking can though. I like the look of it. Here's the description and stuff. Um, I'm gonna be able to see it that good. Just have to pause it wherever you can see it best, you know. Caution and the warning and stuff. This KU and the other codes. I'm sorry, this can is a little bit hard to see on my tablet. It's where it says like protein and stuff is like too bold. So can't really read it off too well. And the uh, other ingredients. Yeah, you're probably not gonna be able to see this at all hardly. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. But I'm anyway, I'm gonna shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. The can's already like not getting um, that cold. It's already like starting to, you know, get less cold. So I gotta hurry and do this. It's losing its like temperature. Um, we'll gain temperature quickly, I guess. And though it's like not really that hot outside right now, it's like raining and stuff. But yeah, the color is basically clear. So, you want to mean bubbly and stuff? Yeah, but anyway, the scent. Well. Well. Definitely smells different than like your typical, like original um, energy drink. Like a normal original energy drink um, is like a sort of like a Rockstar clone or Red Bull clone. Like a Guarana citrusy type of smell and taste. But um, this is more like a lemon grapefruit or something. Yeah, this still definitely citrus, but um, maybe a hint of vanilla in there or something. <sighs> Very sweet smelling. Reminds me a little bit of the um, like the original Full Throttle energy drink. Has like that same sweet tart type of scent. But, um, maybe a little bit more vanilla, though. Yeah, it's like a, maybe lemon lime or grapefruit. And then maybe a little bit of vanilla or something. It smells very sweet and citrusy, though. Yeah, like really sweet citrusy. But, um, anyway, now I'm going to try it. So here goes. Oh, yeah, boys. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Even though this is like an original flavor, um, this one's actually really lit. Really sweet. A little bit floral. But a very light, um, crisp, refreshing, citrusy, um, vanilla type of taste. Yeah, it's definitely, um... Definitely a little bit grapefruit, but um, also sort of tastes like lemon lime though, a little bit like Sprite. Um, mm -hmm. it's like you got um Sprite and maybe mix some like grapefruit stuff in it, then maybe also mixed a little bit of vanilla extract in there. It tastes like this, so it's like a really sweet um, very clean citrusy um vanilla type of flavor. See what I mean? It's actually really good. Um, but yeah, um, actually has zero sugar. Uh, I'm not 
really for sure. I don't see it worth their all in the ingredients, but um, has a sucralose powder, I guess, for the sweetener, I guess. But um, yeah, it has no artificial colors, so you know, that's why it's clear, but I'm um, anyway. But yeah, it's really sweet though. I think this is my first energy drink that I reviewed that's made with sucralose powder instead of like a erythritol or like normal sugar, you know. So that's interesting. But yeah, it has a cool can design. I like the look of it. I like the colors and stuff. Um, it's a little bit hard to see with the text and stuff though. And it's reflective and the text is like too bold down there where it like says protein and stuff. Too much ink. And yeah, the rest of the can is definitely a little hard to see. I might be able to see it a little bit easier now. But um, anyway, yeah. Still a really good energy drink. Um, definitely try it if you can find it. It's 7-Eleven exclusive, I guess. It's like their store brand. Um, it has 200 milligrams of caffeine, so oh yeah, boys, it will get you lit, you know? So oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. It'll definitely get you lit, I'd say energy-wise. Um, it's not as strong as the Bang energy drinks and stuff, because it has like 100 milligrams less. It has more of the l theanine and stuff. It doesn't say how much it is in it, though, of the l theanine anyway. But um, I'd say energy-wise, it lasts probably about maybe four hours to about six hours of energy at the most. So, you know, it definitely works pretty good. I uh, definitely think it was okay price. It could have been definitely cheaper, you know, especially since it's their store brand. <laughs> but yeah, um, so the taste is really good. Energy-wise, it works really good. It has a cool can design. Definitely try it. It's actually really lit. See what I mean? It's actually really good, especially for an original energy drink. This might be one of my favorite original energy drinks. I actually really like this. Um, anyway, I'm going to give the original Triton energy drink. You know what, boys? You know what? I actually really like this. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Oh, yeah, boys, it's lit. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Definitely try to even find it. It's actually really good, especially for a store brand energy drink. I just wish it was cheaper, you know, but it has a cool can design, and the taste is really good. Very sweet, um, citrusy type of taste. And energy-wise, it works really good, so, yeah, definitely try to even find it. It's actually really lit. I give it a 10 out of 10. So, oh, yeah, boys, it's lit. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I give it a 10 out of 10. Oh, yeah. Anyway, my next two reviews are going to be the two other flavors of these Triton Energy drinks that I got. Stay tuned for those reviews. Stay tuned for more reviews, some more videos, and some more watching. See you guys later. Peace out, and bye.